All right, let's look at the next question. It says the graph below indicates the energy sources used for cooking in different provinces. So these are the provinces of South Africa. And obviously this will be slightly clearer for you. When I printed it, my, my printer just be doing its own thing. But these are show, it's showing within each province how it's split the, between the different forms of ways that you can cook, right? And it's probably going to ask us to interpret this a bit. Use the graph above to answer the questions that follow. Identify the source of energy that is mostly used for cooking. Okay, so in all of these, which one looks like it's mostly used? It's kind of this white little block at the bottom, right? Which we can see correlates to electricity. So you just say here, electricity. So it's important that you're able to read graphs. Then it says, name the province that uses the most wood for cooking. So wood is this kind of like strappy stripe. Right, so the stripey stripe, their stripey stripe, stripey stripe, stripey stripe. But you can see clearly that Limpopo uses the most, right? Because you can see it's the largest proportion there. So we're going to say Limpopo. We're doing sterlingly here. Right, it then says the price of paraffin fluctuates. Right, so basically it's saying it, it changes. On 3 of February 2021, the price was this much. Um, and that's cents. That's what the little cent means. Write down in rands um, the close, the cost of one liter. So it's saying each liter is this many cents. Now, how do we convert cents into rands? We divide by 100 because there's 100 cents in a rand. So we're going to say, um, let me just show you here, 764.59. And you're going to divide it by 100. And that will give you answer in rands, right? Um, so I'm going to say here A. So just do show your working. So say 764.59 divided by 100. And it's going to be 7.6459 rand per liter. Just round it off so that we are in the correct realm. Okay. There's your answer there. Let's move on to the next question. Determine to the nearest rand the cost of... 12,5 liters of paraffin, okay? So now we know this is one liter, so we need to say 7.65, and we're gonna times it by 12.5, because that's how many liters we want. So we're gonna put that in there, 7.65, and we're gonna times it by 12.5, and it's gonna equal 95.63 rand. But importantly, did we, did we actually answer the question? No, because it said to the nearest rand. So if we round this to the nearest rand, we have to say it is 96 rand. Why? Because when we're rounding off, we want to basically round this off so that our decimals fall away. So we look at our first decimal. This is above 5, right? It's 5 and above that you round up. So this you're going to round up and it's going to be 96. So remember that when you're rounding off. Also be very careful to actually read your questions because students often forget this and they lose marks. Then it says, name another form of energy that could be used for cooking, which could fall under the other category. Okay, so the other category is this kind of this um, this kind of other stripes at the top there. So it basically is saying something that's not electricity, gas, paraffin, wood. So you could say, um, for example, solar. That's probably a good one. That's probably quite a likely one. You could say solar. You could also say like hydropower, but like in South Africa, solar is more common. Okay, so that's that question done.